Good news, especially for firefighters ahead of the 4th of July. The drought in Missouri is pretty much non-existent this year. Now, last year's drought monitor that you see here on the right, the oranges and reds refer to severe or even worse drought, which was all over the map, as you can see here. Charmel O'Dell spoke with firefighters who say that could lead to a less hectic holiday weekend. Charmel. Rob, well, fire officials tell me more wildfires were started on the 4th of July more than any other day throughout the year. That's why they really want to stress the importance of staying safe. You take safety with the fireworks pretty serious. Friday, father and son Jody and Judah Easter chose to spend the day bonding while picking out their favorite fireworks. 4th of July has always been a big holiday for me. My father and I, uh, we used to come and get fireworks together, and it's uh, an experience I wanted to have with my son. That father and son moment is what dozens of families will share over the next few days. And for the Franklins, it's become a tradition. We lost my wife in 21, and uh, we decided since we, me and my son and my youngest son all have served in the service that uh, we would celebrate the 4th of July because my wife loved fireworks too. Around this time of the year, we usually face a drought risk, making it harder to set off fireworks. We're really not in a bad spot for it. However, it's been very warm for several days, for even a few weeks. Uh, and all of that counts. The last two years, Missouri's governor has signed executive orders to respond to the extreme droughts. It wasn't until this spring that the Ozarks pulled out after a lot of heavy rain. Essentially, we live with an area that has a lot of lakes and streams and, and small rivers, you know, that come through our area. So when those basins fill up from the rainfall, it doesn't necessarily all soak right in. It's flowing straight down to those basins. So those are the types of rains that keep our, our drought down. Although southwest Missouri isn't in a drought, experts say to always ignite fireworks from a hard surface, not on grass or anything that's flammable, and always keep safety in mind. He's kind of taught us, you know, that you can have fun, but be smart about it and take into care take in, you know, that there's other people around you that could be affected if you do something dumb. Have fun and stay safe lighting fireworks. It's 100% it. And here's another good option for you all. You can also go to events like this one right behind me in Republic and let pyrotechnics take care of setting that big grand finale for you. In Republic, I'm Charmelle Odell, KY3 News.